Hey guys, in today's video, I'm going to try to make this hair straightening cream. I came across a YouTuber that used this um, method. She made this rice with coconut milk and olive oil. And she said that this straightened her hair. So I was very curious. I said, well, if this is what she said, let me try this on my hair. So you will see me. As you can see, I'm preparing uh, the rice. I'm going to show you step by step how I prepare the rice until make it to the cream. And I am also going to show you um, the result of how my hair looks like and what I think about this product. So if you have any question regarding this, please let me know in the comment below and I will answer all your questions. Okay, the next step is to blend the rice. As you can see, the rice look very cold. I let the rice cool down for way too long and I put too many rice in the blender so that won't be good but any tips for me do not put too many rice in the blender if you want to have this creamy creamy rice but i end up reducing the amount of rice out of the blender so now i have my creamy rice but one thing i need to tell you is that there was still some little bit of some little pieces in the in the creamer but that's okay so the cream is done and the next is to mix all of the oil and coconut milk with the rice Okay guys, next, this is how my hair looks like before the treatment. I'm going to shampoo it, section it in four 
section and then applying the treatment on my hair. Guys, I apologize because seeing this, it makes me laugh because the thing is, I didn't even know that thing fell on my back. But anyway, I am done applying the cream on my hair. And to be honest, um, during the process when applying this on my hair, my hair really felt um, freezy, like I couldn't separate the pieces to apply the cream on my hair because my hair really fell stuck into the cream but overall the my hair tend to to absorb the cream easily i guess but the process when applying it mm, makes me think but anyway this is what is left I did make way too much but yeah on my hand you can see that there are some uh, not some but there are a lot of tiny pieces of rice left in the cream uh, in the cream 
So that means I will have to wash my hair very good. And I am afraid I won't be able to take all of the, the tiny rice pieces out of my hair. But we're going to see. I'm going to leave this for 30 minutes. And after 30 minutes, I'm going to rinse it well with water, uh, look water, not warm, but look a little bit cold. And then I'm going to sh shampoo my hair. Okay, guys, my hair is air dry. I didn't put anything, no leave-in conditioner, no oil completely nothing because i wanted to see how my how the result will be we will be like and as you can see my hair is shining without any kind of lotion or oil so let's take it out and see how this looks like no oil, no leave-in conditioner. Look how shiny it looks. You see? I don't know if you can see it, but I still have some rice pieces in my hair. Oh my god. Mm. Okay. Okay. Guys, no oil no lotion but my hair don't don't feel like it is there is something on it but it feels soft you know normally when you put it oil on your hair you can feel it on your hands but i don't feel any anything but it feels like i put something on my hair but but of course there was but of course um I put olive olive oil in it so I think that is why my hair looks so shiny and moisturized and the coconut milk also hmm okay I like it My new girl underneath is very soft. My hair feels so soft, so soft, it's strange. The, something strange because when I use the product on my hair, that the, the treatment, my hair felt very hard. It didn't make my hair soft or something like that. It felt hard. And after I wash it out, it was still like freezy hard. And then I shampoo my hair with my dangling shampoo. And that's when my hair became soft again. So yeah, seeing the result, 
I am surprised. I didn't expect it to, to look like this. It feels so soft. My hair feels very soft. I don't know if you can see it but let me show you see my clothes see the rice is still in on my hair you see so every time I do like this you see it come on my head so I still have very tiny pieces of rice on me on my hair so So guys, my hair is very hydrated and I think it's because of the olive oil that I put in it and the coconut oil. So, I'm very happy with it, but the only thing is that the rice was not well blended. I mean, it's very hard to blend a rice in a blender because they're tiny rice is from tiny rice has these little tiny pieces and it's very hard to to blend it very well so if i can manage to blend it well without having this little piece of sand then i think it will be fine because i still have it on my hair my, my entire clothes is full of of those white sand so mm. but anyway my hair looks very hydrated. So guys, this is the result. I'm going to put some oil in it, some leave-in conditioner maybe, but I think my hair doesn't need a leave-in conditioner anymore. I think I'll just put a, a hair oil and just put some on my scalp and then I'm done for the day. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you like this video. If you want, you can try this also, but make sure you you blend the rice very well so that you won't have the same result as me, as I have now, that all the pieces are falling down. But overall, my hair is very moisturized and it is very soft, it's easy to detangle, and I'm happy. If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe, comment, share, and like. Thank you very much for watching. Bye.